Hi, this is Dale O'Shills, pastor of Church of the Redeemer in Gaithersburg, Maryland. Thank you so much for joining me for our devotional time. We're talking about how to make sure that we maintain our energy and how do we stay strong on the inside? How do we make sure that we're fully energized to do God's work and God's will? Now, one of the things that will help you and me to do this is by making sure that we are uh, lining up our words uh, in ways that actually increase energy and positive, uh, positive thinking in our life. A faith-filled thinking. I'd like to use that phrase more so than positive thinking. Faith-filled thinking. And uh, what, one of the things that uh, we, don't, we often don't realize is the power in our tongue, what we say. And the fact that we can actually make statements that can turn us either in the wrong direction or in the right direction. We can have this self-talk or even talk that comes from our mouth that can set us up for success or for failure. Again, the power of life and death is in the tongue. So I want to encourage you, if you're going to maintain energy in your life, you have to have good confessions. You have to make good, strong statements about your life. So let me share with you some statements that are always beneficial, uh, perhaps to make every day and throughout your day. As you go through your day, start your day with the fact that you say to God, God, I am grateful for my life. I'm grateful for you. Acknowledge gratitude and appreciation to God. We've talked about the power of gratitude in this series, but I want to encourage you to each day say, God, I want to express an ex I want to give to you an expression of my gratitude to you. Make the declaration every day of your life that I have a God-given purpose. I'm not an accident today. I have, there's a purpose for my life. And that confession of God's purpose sets you, uh, uh, makes you attentive to what God wants to do in and through you that day. And then declare that, you know what, today is my day to be a blessing. Today is my day to serve. Today is my day to share the love and message of Jesus Christ with someone else. So let there be this intentional de declaration that I am going into my day to be a blessing to other people, to bring God's love to the people around me. And then as you go to your work day, make sure that you de declare each day, my work is my worship. I'm going to give my best to my work today because as I do, I'm not just doing a job, but I'm actually bringing worship to God. I tell you that when you take that attitude toward your work and begin to understand that your work is a part of your worship, then it brings energy to all that you do. And then make sure that you declare each day that God is present for you. As you go through your day, realize that I'm not alone, that God is with me. And thank Him. God, I thank you for your presence. I thank you that you are with me as I'm going through this day. I'm not just in this day alone. You are with me. And then finally, thank God every day and reflect upon the good plan that God has for you. That God is unfolding a plan for your life that is always good. He's always working toward your benefit and toward your blessing. When you begin to change your, your speech, the way you talk about life, the way you talk to yourself about life, the way you talk to others about life, the words that you speak, the power of those words can produce freshness and energy to you. So make sure you're speaking the right things that will produce the right kind of energy in your life and in the people around you.